Hey guys! So first I'm going to start off with this white cream makeup and you guys can get this in Party City for $2 um, and then I'm going to take my plate where I'm going to mix all my cream colors so there I'm squeezing the white cream makeup then I'm going to take my blue cream makeup and squeeze that beside the white Next I'm taking this green cream makeup and this is optional I just wanted to make sure that I had the right color for her skin tone and just mix all the colors together when you have the perfect um, coloring that you like then start applying that to your face And make sure to use some water with this cream makeup because it applies so much better that way. And if you're planning to do your whole arms and some parts of your legs, you might probably need about six cream makeup, uh, the white ones and two of the blue ones. So here I'm painting my neck and I used about two layers of that cream makeup just so all my skin was covered up. Now I'm taking my white eyeliner by NYX and I'm just going to start applying that on my entire eyelids. Emily has really big round eyes so I'm just trying to replicate the same eyes on top of my eyelids. So I'm just going to apply that all over and then I'm going to go over it one more time with the white paint. Okay, so this is the part where I'm going to start looking really creepy because I'm going to paint my eyelashes white and underneath my eyes just so when I close my eyes at the end, my natural eyes will be invisible. Time for shading and this is really important. So here I'm going to take this blue, dark blue eyeshadow and using my fluffy brush, I'm gently going to apply that around the white circles of the eyes. After you're done shading around the eyes, bring the shading down the sides of your nose to make your nose appear smaller. And then I'm going to shade a little triangle on the side of my face and this is where all the teeth is going to be peeking out from. I almost forgot the step, so if you have any problem with the paint creasing in your eyes, just pat a white eyeshadow on top. Now you're going to need a black cream makeup or a black liquid eyeliner and just start outlining around the white paint on your eyes. And make sure you rest your elbow on something steady so you have better control of your hand. Then I'm taking the same black eyeliner and creating her eyelids. After the eyelids, I'm going to draw the eyebrows. So I'm going to basically draw the eyebrows on my forehead and then just curve it down to my eyes. This is my favorite part. So all I'm doing for the eyelashes is drawing little lines around the corners of my new eyes. Um, that sounds kind of weird. around. Emily's eyes the eyes are almost complete all I'm doing now is drawing a giant dot on top of my eyelids so now I can see you guys with my eyes closed for the nose Emily has little tiny triangles so I'm just gonna do the same thing And then I'm going to create the rotting part on the side of her face. So I'm just taking the same black eyeliner and creating a little triangle. And then I'm going to do a little teeth like effects in there. She also has a rotting on the side of her forehead. So I'm going to take my blue eyeshadow and just dab that on there. Emily has the biggest plumpiest lips ever. Even Angelina Jolie got nothing on her. So I'm going to take my pink lipstick and I'm just